What's up guys? Hope you guys are having an awesome day. Welcome back to the vlog. Today, me and my brother are gonna show you guys using the new chicken plucker. Now we're gonna get the water heated up, go grab one of them meat birds, and we'll show you guys the process. Probably just uh, plucking it to see this how this thing works, and you guys can see for yourself if it works good or if it doesn't. But we're gonna go ahead and get this water uh, hot, and we'll come back and we'll show you guys the chicken. Yeah, it's a windy day today. We got our cone set up uh, for the kill and all that stuff, so we'll show you guys a little bit of it. You can see I put the cone up there. Check this out. Look what I had to use for a washer. Found, I found an old key. There's a big hole on the back side that I couldn't find any washers, so I just used that key. Works pretty good. I'll show you guys the chicken plucker real fast. It's just a cheap one I got off Amazon. I don't know if it's going to work. I just had mixed reviews on it, so I'll show it to you. My brother's got it. I'll show it to you guys. Turn on. Faster. Looks like it's going slow on the camera, but it's actually going really fast. Kind of crazy. I'm gonna do. Put it right here, Vincent. I'm gonna clamp it. I'm gonna clamp it down with the C clamp I got, and then we're gonna try it this way. Right here in a second. Hold it. All right, guys. We got the water up to uh, 150, so we're gonna go ahead and uh, put it in there. Move it around. I'm gonna need your help. Can duck it in there, move it around a little bit. It'll start to pull out pretty easy. A couple more seconds. Try this. We're gonna do this chicken plug to see how good it works. Check it out. You can see it worked pretty freaking good. One thing is, this this is a young bird still, so it did rip. It ripped the skin. So the next one we do, I'm gonna try something different and show it to you guys. The stuff I read it says if you once you dip it in your hot water, then put it down in some ice cold water um, and chill it just for a second. It'll help uh, prevent for the skin from tearing. So we'll try that next, and I'll show it to you guys. Okay, now we're gonna do one. We're gonna dip it in the hot water. Then I'm gonna dip it in the I got some cold water, ice water right here. We're gonna dip it in, and then we're gonna uh, depluck and see how it works as far as not tearing the skin on this one. Does it say to, uh, immediately after? Now you've really done your job with the, the hot. Okay, cause you can see it works pretty good. And I think dipping it in the cold ice water does work better um, as far as not these young birds. The, this one you can see didn't get all ate up, didn't all tore up the wing. A little bit on the wing did get tore up, but it's that's a soft spot anyways, whatever. But overall, I think probably dipping it is a better idea in the cold water. So I'm gonna go ahead and finish cleaning this up and then I'll, I'll talk to you guys in a second. Hey, what's up guys? Super windy out here, so I'm gonna make this short. Um, this. I can't remember what it's called. I don't even know, what, I don't even know the name brand of it. I'll put, I'll put a link down below uh, for my Amazon account if you guys are interested in getting one of these. I got a package. 
I got a package deal with the, the funnel, this, and a little knife. Knife is pretty good, pretty sharp. I uh, stayed sharp, but we only uh, butchered five chickens. Um, so I used this on five chickens, and um, I've only butchered a few oh, roosters, probably like five or six roosters before, and I just hand plucked them. This is definitely better than hand plucking. I mean, I mean definitely better. Um, in the future, I probably would like to get a, a real big plucker uh, if you're going to do 25 or 30 meat birds like I'm doing. But we only, we only did five today. And uh, so that was good for what it is. If you're only doing a handful, that works great. But if you're going to do like 30 of them, I don't know. But all right, guys, I'll show you these uh, chickens real quick and then I'm going to get off here. You can see, pork pretty good. For the most part, uh, worked pretty good for what we're using it for. And it got really cold and windy out here, so we were kind of in a hurry to get them done. I was wanting to do like 10 today, but we decided let's just do five because the cold front rolled in. But all right, guys, so if you like, like this quick vlog over the chicken plucker, if you did, smash that like button for me if you would. If you're not subscribed to my channel, please subscribe. And thanks for watching.